here with the owner of the first food truck devoted entirely to what I call nature's candy, bacon. This man is a genius. Please welcome Jerry Crowley from the Lardon Food Truck. I love the smell of bacon. I love the sound of bacon cooking. I love all things bacon. Is this true that everything you sell has bacon in it? Everything has bacon in it, Conan. It's bacon-centric, so everything. There's, if you come here, you're going to have bacon if you like it or not. Okay, well, that's a, a weird thing to say. <laughs> I wouldn't put that in your sales pitch. How did you come up with the idea to do this? Well, my wife, Heather, and I were just, you know, hanging out, drinking margaritas and talking about bacon uh, and <laughs> thinking it would be a great idea to have a that's restaurant. That's all great ideas are thought of. <laughs> and that's it. I mean, and then we bought it, or we... You know, started a food truck because we couldn't afford a restaurant. And uh, So this is a truck. You drive around and you serve food that's just jammed with bacon. Yes. And made of bacon. Everything. Okay. Uh, now, is it regular bacon? Is it special bacon? Is it pork bacon? What, what are we talking about here? It, there's all different types. We use the real bacon. We use that skinny, like, junky bacon that you get, like, over at, like, a fast food place. This is thick-cut bacon. It's almost like a pork chop. It's so meaty and thick. So you really get your, your money's worth with this bacon. And, uh, yeah, it's not like this off-the-store, you know, off-the-shelf type of bacon. It's just really good bacon. There's, you know, pepper bacon and duck bacon and wild boar bacon, different types, you know. How much bacon do you eat a week? Uh, you know, on the truck, I could eat up to, like, four pounds a week. <laughs> Are you worried at all about your health? I mean, that's... No, no, no. There's, you know, there's bigger things to worry about than your, than your health. <laughs> no. There is, no, no, right? No. I mean... No. <laughs> No, don't applaud that idea. That's exactly <laughs> wrong. <laughs> Health is the most important thing. So, so you eat four to five pounds of bacon a week. Have you had your arteries checked? No, I have not, no. <laughs> so you could just go at any time right now, is that? You know, if I did, at least I went out eating what I want to eat when I wanted to eat it, so. I like that idea. Yeah. That's a great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they started chanting USA. <laughs> Uh, okay, now, do you believe bacon has any healthy properties? Are you one of those guys that tries to say, oh, there's some actually some good things about bacon? Well, yeah, no, I mean, like, I was, like, there's a few things, like, you feel good about eating it, but, yeah, I, I met this diabetic guy at a party, and he told me that something with bacon's good for your, like, pancreas, so, I mean, there's gotta be some things. So you've done thorough studies, that's, uh... <laughs> I met a guy at a party <laughs> who told me it's good for my pancreas. Yeah. Yeah. Well, good, uh, do you put brown sugar on bacon? That's one of my favorite things to do. Yeah, that's candy bacon, and uh, I, I don't eat candy bacon, I mean, but you can. <laughs> but my kids do, they have a sweet tooth. What do you, you, you call me, a wuss, because I like a little sugar on my bacon? No, it's good, it's good. It's you just, just said you like bacon every single way, and then the one way I suggest you're like, no, I wouldn't do that. No, I just said I wouldn't eat it. That's a bad idea. I'd still eat it. All right, uh, uh, we, well, tell me, what are we gonna make here, quickly? Because we, uh, we, we need to get into this. Sure, what we're gonna do, we're gonna make the Baco Taco. It's a bacon shell taco, pretty much. It's a, a shell of thick cut bacon filled with uh, potatoes and cheddar cheese. So, yeah, right? I mean, that's, a, that's real stuff right there. This is fantastic. So, a taco shell filled with unhealthy things, and then the taco shell itself is made of bacon. Exactly, yeah. Okay, fantastic. All right, so what we do, let's grab some bacon real quick and lay it down. Okay. I, uh, uh, you can too? grab it. Yeah. Yeah, we right. got some extra, don't worry. Okay, I got some right here. Yep. All right, go ahead. And then you just put them down, six across. Okay. And hey, what is this, it? by the way? There's a bottle of liquor here. That is uh, bacon-infused bourbon. Ah! That we use to make our bacon and uh, bourbon uh, syrup. Can you get a look at that in there? Look at that. There's just fat floating in this bourbon. <laughs> Do you drink this? I haven't tried that yet, no, but I would. <laughs> <laughs> It's good. Mm. It's good. USA! <laughs> USA! 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 That's great. That's great. <laughs> I've never been more proud of my country. <laughs> all right, yeah, so go ahead and just lay those down like that. Once you uh, get them all across, now we're going to do the weave. This is very important, everybody. <laughs> okay. Are you ready? <laughs> this is very important. It is. Pay attention. It is. You have to weave it. So you go over, under, over, under. Right. That's like what weaving so. is. Yeah. This is this is part of the structural integrity of the Baco Taco. <laughs> okay. It's it's uh you know if if you don't do this right, you're only gonna have a bunch of strips of bacon, which is fine also. So it's a yeah. win-win. <laughs> I love that even if you do it wrong, you're pretty much fine. That's with everything. right.